Robert Downey Jr. was just snapped on the set of his new HBO series, The Sympathizer, and it'll have you doing a double take. Boy, this is really kind of cool. Yep, that's Robert looking completely unrecognizable on set in Los Angeles, sporting receding curly red hair and bleached eyebrows, while donning a burgundy jacket and a pink shirt with a white tee, complete with navy pants and brown shoes. It's wild. The fictional drama slash thriller follows a half French, half Vietnamese man, played by Hoa Swan Day, who was a spy for communist forces during the Vietnam War. Sandra Oh also stars in the series, which is based on the 2015 book by the same name. As for Robert, well, he's playing multiple supporting roles. I need your help. You know how I'm starting this project soon? Yeah, the sympathizer? Yeah, the sympathizer. I don't want to have to wear a ball cap, so will you guys shave my head? That was the actor back in October enlisting the help of his kids to prep for the role. The A-lister who shares a 29-year-old son, India, with his ex-wife, Deborah Falconer, as well as two kids, 10-year-old Exton and 8-year-old Avery with his wife, Susan Downey, gave his younger kids a razor and let them go to town buzzing his head. Great job, guys. I'll let you get back to your pumpkin carving, but what do I owe you? Keep your money. Avery's got a better idea. Happy Halloween. I'm just pleased that it's entertaining. Robert captioned the clip, quote, the things we do for our work and our kids. Hashtag sympathizer set ready. I just have to sacrifice. A few days later, the actor debuted his new do, or lack thereof, on the red carpet at the premiere of Netflix's documentary Senior, which tells the life story of his late father, filmmaker Robert Downey Sr. It's a bit of a foray into trying to understand your dad. Do you feel like you understand him now? I have a feeling I'll know a lot more when we're done. Of course, Robert's newest project comes after playing Tony Stark in the Iron Man franchise for over a decade. Tony Stark, just such an interesting, conflicted guy because he's a weapons manufacturer, but it's the relationships really. A bunch of my favorite actors would come together to do this. It's so much fun. Back in 2019, Robert discussed transitioning out of superhero life after playing the pivotal role in the Marvel Cinematic Universe since its inception in 2008. I had an incredible 10-year run that was creatively satisfying, it was very, very, very hard work and I dug very deep, but I have not been forced to explore the new frontier of, of what is my creative and personal life after this. Well, fast forward a few years, and it seems safe to say he's digging deep into his new role and getting into character all over again.